Only days after Dr. Leslie Cargyle and her husband, William Allen Cargyle, went missing, her medical office was shut down. The two were later found dead in Texas as thousands of patients scrambled to find a new doctor. Now there's word the practice is reopening under new management. News 13's Mario Boone is streaming live from the medical office in Black Mountain. The patients are already showing up, aren't they, Mario? Well, they were earlier for sure. They are showing up here happy this medical office here in Black Mountain is back open. We're going to open tomorrow here. Good news returns to the medical clinic where tragedy struck in August. The practice can continue, but it has to have a physician manager. That's where Dr. Drew Snyder comes in. Fresh from the Air Force, where he served as a flight surgeon, Snyder will reopen the medical clinic of Dr. Leslie Cargyle, who went missing last month, then was found dead with her husband in Texas, August 29th. The intention of the Cargyles, uh, the family was, and the estate attorney, was to try to maintain, you know, the practice. This will just be a part of her living on. Vicki Brigman was a 17-year patient of Dr. Cargyle. Leslie was just a friend, and the best doctor. Sentiments echoed by others who stopped by after learning the clinic is coming back. So happy they're reopening. You do not know how much it means to me. With this piece of the puzzle solved, one thing stays a mystery. Why the Cargyles apparently took their own lives in a Texas motel room. All right, so the clinic here in Black Mountain reopens for patients tomorrow. The office in Old Fort reopens for patients on Monday. Reporting live tonight in Black Mountain, I'm Mario Boone, News 13.